Hey everybody, Tall Rider 75 here. And uh, next mod I'm going to do for my Ninja 650 is for the windshield. Now, I already modified the windshield by buying a uh, zero gravity sport touring windshield, but uh, what I want to do is I'm going to black it out with a decal on it. So, what I've ordered, my bike is green if you've seen any of my other videos. So, I found on eBay this uh, chrome green. Uh, Punisher decal and what I'm going to do is I'm going to position that on the windshield and then I'm going to black it out using Plasti Dip. Now the reason that I'm going to use Plasti Dip is because if, you, if you're not familiar with Plasti Dip you can uh, you can peel it off if uh, you ever want to go back to stock. Same with the, uh, because this is a vinyl decal, it'll come off no problem. And if I ever want to go back just to a plain clear windshield to change it up, then I can do that. So what, uh, what I'm going to use for this, i just uh, got some shop towels, I've got some regular Windex, I've got some alcohol uh, to remove the residue after I clean it up. And I've got some uh, green painter's tape for masking. Uh, the areas that I don't want plasti dipped, and I've got my decal, of course. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this up, and uh, then I'm going to wipe the back side of the windshield uh, down with uh, the alcohol, so that um, I'll get better adherence with the uh, plasti plasti dip. I just don't want any uh, any residue from the uh, Windex or window uh, cleaner, and then I'll uh, plasti dip it from the back and uh, it should should come out uh, looking pretty good. I haven't done this before but uh, I've seen enough videos on the plasti dip and uh, whatnot to have a pretty good idea how it's going to come out but uh, I'll get it cleaned up and uh, show you the next step. Okay so with the assistance of my helpers here who's camera shy <laughs> and the other one who's sitting on the uh, floor here I've uh, cleaned up the windscreen. Now unfortunately I thought that the color was uh, the same on both sides and it's silver actually on the back side which um, I don't know maybe the silver would be would be good. I, I, this way it's on the outside of the uh, on the outside of the screen and uh, I'm not sure that I wanted that. I wanted it on the inside to be covered by the um, Plasti Dip on the inside, but uh, I'll see how see how this works. It, it actually doesn't look too bad with the silver as well. The silver on the black would, uh, would look pretty good. Okay, so I did decide that I'm going to uh, have the silver facing out. Um, this will allow me to have the uh, decal uh, showing from the inside of the windshield out. The reason, the main reason I did this is uh, because I don't want the decal on the outside. If the windshield is getting hit by bugs or, or dirt or anything like that, I want to be able to, to fully clean it without worrying about scraping the decal off. If it's on the inside, then uh, I don't need to worry about that. Um, the other reason is, I mean, there's lots of green on the bike. The silver will set it off a little bit. It's, uh, it still looks nice, and, and against the black, it'll look really cool, I think. Um, so while that's uh, setting, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mask off the rest of the uh, area here that I don't want to have any Plasti Dip, which is mostly on the outside here um, of the windscreen, and we'll... Uh, see what that looks like okay <laughs> Punisher dog um, so I have uh, masked this off I've decided that I am gonna black out the entire screen <laughs> stop it you um, so I'm gonna go and play spray on the uh, first coat of Plasti Dip um, not taping that because uh, there's plenty of videos on how to apply Plasti Dip so and go outside, do that. It's pretty dark outside, so you wouldn't see much anyway. And uh, <laughs> one more. <laughs> That's too funny. I think it's funny anyway. Let's see. 
<laughs> uh, little things amuse me. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go Plasti Dip this and uh, show you the final result after a couple coats. So just to show you, that's the uh, first coat. Uh, i got to wait 30 minutes before I can uh, apply the second coat. But um, in any case, and then I'll take off the uh, masking after the four hours that uh, they say to leave it uh, for once it's it should be dry. And with any luck, it'll look good. But again, the nice thing about this is, is that if it doesn't, I can just peel it off and uh, go back to stock. Love this stuff. Okay, so... Here's the uh, windscreen after the uh, Plasti Dip has dried and I ended up putting three coats on and you can sort of see it's a little deceptive sometimes like there's there's a little bit of, uh, of uh, area showing through here where you can see that the Plasti Dip's a little thin so I'm gonna maybe add another another coat just to black out the the thin area here a little bit more but it's sort of hard because when it's on the ground when you're actually uh, putting the Plasti Dip on it's hard to see um, it, it really won't make that much difference I don't think but uh, we'll see if I feel like putting another coat on Either way, I think it looks uh, it looks pretty good. That silver uh, decal looks uh, looks pretty good, and uh, from the front, it's not going to make that much of a difference whether I whether I put uh, put that extra coat on or not. So I may not even bother. The only issue will be if uh, if I go to peel it off. Is it is it uh, going to come off in one one piece uh, the way it should? So I may just uh, throw some a little bit of extra touch up there, just uh, to make it even. Okay, so here it is. I've uh, taken off all the uh, tape, and there's some orange peel um, areas. Uh, this is my first time ever doing a Plasti Dip spray so uh, I know there's some people who will probably say that I did it wrong then if there's some orange peel um, areas but uh, I definitely learned uh, from this experience and that's what it's about right so and I think it looks pretty good I'm gonna throw it on the bike and uh, see how it looks on it okay so here it is I think it looks uh, pretty good the only issue that I've uh, been able to see right away is that um, dust, like any black vehicle surface, uh, dust is going to show pretty quickly on this, but as long as I keep it clean, I think it'll look pretty good. And uh, the other thing I don't need to worry about is when the sun, they, they always say that with these uh, clear plastic, uh, windscreens that you can have the sun magnified and it could damage your uh, speedometer and your controls um, so obviously I won't have a have an issue with that um, but again the the real benefit of this is that if I decide that I want to go back to clear all I have to do is uh, peel the Plasti Dip off and uh, and I, I also think that I'm happy with the silver uh, choice I think it goes well with the zero gravity logo which is uh, much more visible now uh, and it also matches well with the uh, mounting screws there so so uh, yeah I'm happy with it I think it looks good and uh, can always go back thanks for watching